If this picture of unit circle makes you to throw your phone hard and it also breaks, then give me a minute to make you memorize this all. Part 2. In part 1, we went over a super cool trick how to fill out all the values up here to finish up the circle. Let's now copy and paste all these values across the x and y axis. Traveling from the center out, we get negative x, positive y here, negative x, negative y over here, and positive x, negative y here. Now let's add 90 degrees to each corner. So 90 plus 90 is 180, and 180 plus 90 is 270. Splitting 90 and 180 in half and thirds? Let's copy everything across the y-axis, like you're folding this piece of paper in half. We're gonna get the exact same values over here, but now all the x values, which is everything on the left, is now negative. For the bottom part of the circle, let's split 182 to 70, and a half and thirds and again with 272 360. Everything over the x-axis dot like we're folding this piece of paper in half. We get the same values as well. But now everything is negative on the bottom left. And the y values are negative on the bottom right. And there we have it. You just filled out the unit circle.